So my paper was about immigration and is it's um, legal immigrants versus undocumented immigrants. And what my research showed was that immigration, in fact, is a very good thing for our economy mostly. Um, it does boost our economy in a, a really good way. Um, these individuals provide an infusion of human capital value to our economy of around $314 billion a year, which is equivalent to 1.9% of GDP. And to put that into perspective, the human capital infusion arriving annually across our borders would pay for more than half of our annual defense expenditures or more than 60% of our Medicaid spending. So I think immigration is is a, a positive thing, uh, more so than not. Um, now not, and it, it brings a cultural diversity, you know, different music, different literature, um, different writing styles, language. Um, I could go on culinary, um, uh, all kinds of different things that, that brings value to our economy in a lot of different ways. Um, but like I said, not everyone is legal. Um, the downside of immigration and how it affects our economy negatively is because if you're not legally documented, the chances are you're probably not going to do as best as you can in our country when you come over. Um, and with that being said, those types of people usually are high high convict offenders I mean they they um, they're the bad part of immigration that comes into our country but um, and the, the illegal drugs that are brought into our country through undocumented immigration is also a negative impact um, and uh, another negative impact of immigration is they use our support programs um, and they don't pay as much taxes and, and us as the natives here are responsible for that higher tax. So it kind of puts a burden on us natives in the U.S. Um, as far as immigration and um, but I think ultimately the the bigger picture immigration outweighs the bad by the good by a whole lot in many different ways um nowhere's perfect so i think immigration is good for our economy